There has been no clemency for Salah Abdeslam, the sole survivor of the Islamist commando that perpetrated the Paris attacks on November 13, 2015. A Paris court has sentenced him to life imprisonment without the possibility of a shortened sentence for his part in terrorist jihadist attacks that left 130 people dead and more than 400 wounded. Sentences ranging from six years to life imprisonment have also been imposed on 19 of the 20 defendants. The sentences pronounced are not excessive. They are adapted to the facts and to those who committed them. I think that we are at a moment which is a satisfying moment and I hope for everyone in any case for justice. I believe that this extreme severity will satisfy the expectations of a number of our members and a number of victims. The appeal channels are now open and the deadline for appeal is 10 days. Let's wait for 10 days. I think that in the case of very heavy sentences that have been pronounced, certainly we have reason, there will be an appeal and we will have the opportunity to meet and discuss. I believe that if the victims wanted to be in the courtroom today, it was not so much to see the defendants, but to be together. That's been the message for the last six and a half years. That's why they have associations to be together, because the way to face this horror was to rebuild as a group and not individually. We needed to feel each other, to stick together and to hear what justice had to say to us, not after 10 months, after six and a half years, to hear it all together. Among those present, the court did not uphold the request for life imprisonment for three other inmates, who were instead sentenced to 30 years in prison.